So I have been wearing this same suit that I found to be the perfect everyday suit three, four days a week pants and jacket for the last, who knows, five, six months. This suit has everything that you're looking for in a modern suit. It's stretchy and comfortable and lightweight and breathable and perfect for all day wearing every day. Even better, it can be yours for only $130, which is a fraction of the price that most well-made and well-fitting suits cost. Let's dive in a little bit on the Uniqlo AirSense suit. Now we all know about Uniqlo, right? The company that is creating everyday life wear, basically a uniform for you to wear every single day and in a ton of different situations. I actually made another video about Uniqlo and how they're not a fast fashion company. Go ahead and check that out. I'll put it in the link in the description below. But they are continuously on the cutting edge of new technology and new products and offer them at affordable prices. The truest sense of the word value. Now I have two suits. One is a black Calvin Klein suit, which is padded, more formal suit that I wear for more special occasions. And then I have this suit, which I can essentially wear every day and mix and match and feel more comfortable wearing it with a t-shirt, a mock neck shirt, anything under it. Where my black Calvin Klein suit is more structured and rigid and formal, this suit is pretty much the exact opposite. It's unlined, it's lightweight, it's easy to wash and care for, all good things. Constructed with a specialized fabric that Uniqlo has developed with Torre, a mill that's been in business for almost a century now, this suit is flexible, comfortable, easily modifiable, and everything that you're gonna want in an everyday wear suit. Now Uniqlo offers two versions of the suit. They offer one in a wool-like fabric and the other in a cotton-like fabric. I have the wool-like version and I have to be honest, it doesn't feel wholly similar to the Calvin Klein suit that I have, which is wool, but it does still represent sort of a technical feeling everyday wear suit very well. It has plenty of stretch built in mechanically at the fabric level, allowing you to move and stretch very easily and wear this thing all day without even feeling like you're really wearing a suit. I mean, I can wear this all day, not even take this jacket off and do everything that I could normally do if I was just wearing a t-shirt. I mean, if I was wearing nothing, honestly, if I was wearing no shirt, I could do basically all the same stuff. Overall, it is an unstructured jacket, missing some of the padding and the interfacing and the lining that gives a more formal jacket some of its structure, but that's not a bad thing, especially when you're thinking of wearing a suit all day. The fabric also includes a couple different properties that are super helpful for an all day wearing suit, such as quick dry to keep your body temperature well regulated and wrinkle resistance, which definitely shows through. I can stuff this thing in my gym bag at the end of the day, put my gym clothes on, probably leave it in there overnight before I take it out, throw it on the next morning, and it pretty much still looks the same. Same. But before we proceed, if you're enjoying this video right now, if you enjoy fashion content, please consider dropping a like on this video and subscribing to the channel. It'd be very helpful and I look forward to growing this relationship with you in the future. Of course, it does come in standard pant and jacket sizes. For the jacket, we're looking at, you know, whatever, extra small through extra large. And then for the pants, we're looking at the waist size 28 to whatever, 40. But that is apparent with pretty much just about anything that you buy nowadays that you're probably going to need to take it to a tailor and get it fitted perfectly so it looks good on you. I took the pants to a tailor uh, back when I first got this jacket, probably six, seven months ago, and got it hemmed up to my uh, length. And I do plan on taking the jacket to the tailor eventually because the sleeve is a little bit long. Right now, I've sort of just been rolling it. It works for now, but I would love to get it brought up a little bit to get it hitting in the right spot on my wrist. Honestly, with the minimal interior build of this jacket, it's probably a tailor's best friend. I can imagine that it, you can whip up an alteration so quickly in this thing just because it's not lined or no crazy interfacing going on in the interior that you have to rework and restitch. Now, I'm not gonna go in depth into detail about the jacket and the pants, but they do have pretty much all the same details that a standard jacket and suit pant would, besides only having one interior jacket pocket instead of two. There is also, as I mentioned, barely any padding or interfacing on the interior and a little bit of lining. Other than that, they literally mirror my $500 Kelvin Klein suit in every other detail. Maybe the best thing about the suit is that it is machine washable. Suits are notoriously tough to keep clean, to clean when you have to clean them. You have to take them to the dry cleaner. You have to spot clean them with specialized detergents and solvents and things of that nature. But with this suit, you can toss it right into the washer, nice and easy, and hang it up to dry and you have it perfectly clean and ready to go. Now, I I have washed this suit one time since owning it. I don't feel that I really need to wash it a ton because it's pretty antimicrobial because it's lightweight. I, I don't also wear this when I'm sweating a lot. Obviously, I think if you're sweating, a little bit of a different scenario, you should probably wash it a little bit more often. But Uniqlo does suggest to wash this in a mesh bag. I don't have a mesh bag. I just tossed it right into the washer with a bunch of other clothes and 
then hang dried it, of course, and it came out perfectly fine. I would turn it inside out though. They do suggest that, and I would always pretty much turn anything that you wash inside out. And as I mentioned, I've only washed this one time in the past, I don't know how long I've owned it, six or seven months, and it's still all good. You know, I wear cologne, I don't sweat a lot personally. If you do, it's a different scenario, but you can always take this and toss it into the freezer, as weird as that may be, and also spray some Febreze on it to kill any of the bacteria and get it freshened up a little bit if need be. I don't know, I really don't have much else to say about this jet. I wear this suit so often, and it's great fitting coming out of the box, and you can always get it tailored very easily. And like I said, it stretches, it moves with you, you barely even realize that you have have it on it's also very lightweight so you won't really get hot in it unless you're wearing like a, a sweater or something under it but in terms of the individual garments they're built so well it's from uniqlo we all know my feelings about uniqlo and they're a great company overall and they're offering you a great everyday suit so let me know what you think down in the comments below i'd honestly love to know um do you own this suit do you own any other suits from uniqlo do you wear them often i just made a video last week about how important a suit is and how wearing a suit is important for your self-confidence and presenting yourself in the best light so if you haven't seen that video go check it out the link will be in the description below and if you enjoyed this video again please drop a like on the video and consider subscribing to the channel be very helpful that's all i have for y'all today i'll see y'all on wednesday peace out